basically a really awesome helmet. Actually, this is probably the first auto darkening that I'm willing to try. Picked it up, it said shade, I turned it to the setting I wanted, I set the delay as short as possible, and uh, it was very quick and easy to use. I enjoyed the field of view, I enjoyed the wide angle. You can see everything as you go, you can see where you're moving and where you've been if you need to. It helps a lot, yeah. Yeah, it's nice to be able to see around your piece, especially if you get in tight areas. It's nice to have that flexibility where you don't have to move in and out of an area. You have that window for vision, it gives you more peripheral vision. Definitely like that. When we're leaning into a chassis, we can't have our helmet facing straight forward, and we do have to look a little to one side or the other, or a top or a bottom. So I think the uh, larger viewing size is definitely going to be a plus. I really like the comfort factor. It doesn't squeeze your head, and with all the notches, it's very easy to move up and down when you want to get it out of your face. It doesn't fall back down. Being a girl, I'm a lot smaller, so it actually fits me, which is nice. And also the shell, it's a little bit wider, so it covers more on my face, and you know, we girls tend to like that. We don't like being burnt when we're welding. The only problem, though, I have to say with Lincoln, is they're making these look so cool that I don't actually want to use them because they're so pretty. How much better can it get than that now? You know, so I mean, Lincoln, just keep doing what you're doing because I mean, the stuff's rocking.